welcome to NJRoot22.com vlog episode, I don't know, so I'm not going to say it on the uh, episode uh, audio anymore. It's another supermarket, uh, yeah, I'm just going to put it in the description, because uh, this is publishing on uh, May 5th, I believe, but I'm, I can't use the vlog number anymore. I screwed it up, but I'll get back on track. So here's some flyers that we got. Let's see if we got focusing today. We do. Good. It's pretty fast. How many of you are annoyed by the, the package deals that these cable or Wi-Fi companies have, uh, whether it's uh, Time Warner or Xfinity? They give you these great deals, and then it, it goes up, but it, it's never $69. Okay, look at that. It says two-year agreement. It's never $69. There's always hidden fees, FCC fees, taxes, and whatever. They have a million ways to get you. It's usually probably closer to $100 a month. I think we signed up just for internet. It was 50 bucks uh, two or three years ago. It's 100 now. I, how, how did that happen? Anyway, so that's that. Real quick, I'm gonna try and make this quick this week. It's another version of Cinco de Mayo, as you can say. That, that's, as you can see, that's uh, this Saturday, uh, May 5th. But real quick, we, we shop at Bishop's White House, which is an IGA. We shop there because they're local and we just wanna support them every now and then. There's nothing really special this week. They got running price for the avocados. I think that was all. They have new signs on their uh, shelves to make it easier to navigate. Anybody with a pair of eyes should be able to do it. Um, everybody wants to get out of there and rush home. So that, that's all we're talking about. Oh yeah, they got some good, good deal on organic blueberries for $3.99. That's that. We shop there just to give them a business. Kings we go to every now and then. It's just sick how much more money they are than everybody else. They have the Cinco de Mayo thing going as well. Uh, Good price on uh, ground beef, I guess. Four bucks a pound is pretty decent. We gotta buy three pounds or more, so it's gonna be like 12, 13, 14 dollars a pack of meat. But you can make meatballs, chili, all sorts of stuff, anything you want. And there was uh, not much else I wanted to talk about. I wanted to say one thing very importantly any packaged goods anywhere, whether it's carbs, chips, pasta, don't waste your time at any of the supermarkets. Not even my favorite store, ShopRite. None of them because just go to Aldi, you'll get all that stuff, always cheaper, no need to clip coupons. I mean, yeah, maybe there's a, a, a deal every now and then where you get it even cheaper at, at ShopRite in, in uh, conjunction with some coupons, double coupons and all that, but don't waste your time. Buy your packaged crap at Aldi, you'll, you'll, you'll thank me for it. It's so much cheaper and it tastes just as good, if not better. Okay, we're not talking about Stop and Shop this week. Uh, I mean, they got the avocados and the Cinco de Mayo thing going. We're not, we're not going to talk about them this week. We, it's not fair to talk about them. We don't really shop there. We're, we're, what we're going to do is in a future episode, we're going to find, you know, three or five things a week that we think are good or worthy of stopping at Stop and Shop. And that's it. And then we got ShopRite's ahead of the curve here. They have their Mother's Day already. These guys, they, they, they dropped the ball on that. And here, here's an interesting thing. The avocados at... Uh, at Shop right are less than a dollar a piece, and here they're two for five. So, five bucks at uh, Shop Kings gets you two avocados. Five bucks at Shop right gets you five avocados and fifty cents in your pocket. So that's uh, that's that's another reason why uh, the price dictates where we shop. So, some good things here: they, uh, broccoli crowns over at Shop right are a buck a, a buck a pound. And at uh, King's, you can see they're twice as much, $1.99 a pound. And that's on sale, they're normally three bucks a pound. So that's the last of the King's comparisons. Um, we're at four minutes now. I'm gonna try and get this done real quick. Like I said, any packaged goods, ice cream or junk or anything that, that can sit on the shelf, always buy at Aldi. One thing that, I, that ShopRite ha has on sale this week that I'm gonna stock up on is Hamburgers, and I'm gonna make room in the freezer for them because these are the best. The Sweden Sun uh, brisket burgers are delicious. They are delicious, delicious, delicious. They have excellent, consistent texture as well. Unbelievable. Um, right up there, probably tied for first place is the Pat La Frida. Um, although their consistency, sometimes it's a little, uh, they, they get a little cartilage in the burgers. And we've tried these Brooklyn beef burgers. They're frozen, they're like six ounce burgers. or They're okay. They're good to have in a pinch, but then uh, they're big. They're like this big compared to the other ones, which are this big. They're thinner too. 
But the, these are del great deals on the hamburgers. I highly recommend you stock up on the burgers at ShopRite this week. Those are the two best burgers you can get at any supermarket around here, or even a butcher. I like them better. They just taste better. You may have a different uh, palate than, than we do. And of course, they got all this other stuff in here. Uh, their furniture, and uh, they're selling and deals. So we're not going to go into, into all the little things here. I think there was one other thing I marked off. Um, that's it. No. I, I, yeah, here we go. That's the avocados. That's all. That's all for this week. Um, burgers. Burgers are the number one thing. And uh, Cinco de Mayo, I guess. We're not going to do anything like that. Oh, one last thing. We don't, we don't celebrate any holiday here at all. Um, because it's someone else came up with this idea. And I, I, I shouldn't have to be you know, forced to, to do it just because everybody else is. So just keep that in mind. You know, if you want to earn your own your own soul back. Don't follow these things. They just take your money from you. For what? I mean, you can be nice and give people flowers all the time. You don't have to do it because there's some decreed holiday. Because I don't, I don't follow, follow these things. And I don't like even being involved in my own birthday most of the time. So uh, it, there's no need for it. it. It feels forced. Once you step outside the box, you realize it's, it feels forced. But I'd love to have a discussion with somebody on that. That's uh, something worth talking about. Uh, it doesn't validate me. It shouldn't validate you. Uh, but it does validate a lot of people. And what can I say? All right, have a nice weekend.